Hello and welcome to 4313 East Minnesota Street. Here we have a three bedroom, one bath home, uh, right around a thousand square feet. As you can see, there was a detached garage here. Um, the overhead door has been actually sealed up and it's really used as more of a uh, storage room or a little bonus area. We do have a nice uh, iron uh, gate in front of the drive. Now, what used to be the back porch has been completely finished out and turned into more of a utility area. We'll get back to that in a minute. But for right now, let's get inside and take a look around. So as you can see, part of the house has the original hardwood floors. Um, uh, big window in front, another side window, great for natural light, giving it that large, fresh feeling. We do have a coat closet up front. And let me take my shoes off. It's a little bit muddy outside today. So as we walk a little farther back, we can see uh, off to our right, it's a hallway to the private quarters of the home. Uh, we do have uh, eat-in area of the kitchen or overhead chandelier. Now this kitchen will have a uh, stove and refrigerator installed. So you can see we've got not only tile floors, but tile walls behind the sinks, a tile backsplash behind the stove area. So it uh, makes cleanup easy. Keeping the kitchen tidy, it makes it very easy. We'll move on back to our private area of the house. Our first bedroom, immediately to the right, we have a room that's probably about 10 by 10, uh, maybe nine by 10. I don't think it's completely square, so probably nine by 10. Got a good size reach-in closet. It's about six feet wide. Once again, we have the hardwood floors in this area. A little bit further off to the left side, we do have our uh, full bath bathroom. A uh, little linen closet area for towels, sink commode, nice uh, tile area above the vinyl uh, shower surround. To the left is our second bedroom, a little bit larger than the last. Uh, this is probably about 10 by 12 with a cut with a closet that cuts into part of that space. We do have our electrical box here inside the closet. And this closet is right about four feet wide. Now our third and last bedroom. This is the largest bedroom of the house. As you can see, we still have the hardwood floors in this area. Now, all these bedrooms do have overhead lighting and uh, windows for natural lighting. Now, this is a uh, cool little walk-in closet. Uh, they put up wood slats, shelves on either side. So we don't see walk-in closets very often in these older homes, uh, so that's a nice little extra amenity. Now we will go back to the more common area of the house, the kitchen, and then the back utility room, and the little dining area here. So as I said, we do have a uh, eat-in dining area inside the kitchen. We've got our kitchen against this back wall. As I mentioned earlier, we do have uh, tile backsplashes. Now our washer and dryer area are also in the kitchen. Now this is our utility room. Um, it is completely finished out. Our hot water heater is back here, but this would be a great storage area, maybe a game room for the kids. Uh, we've got the old uh, French doors in the back here. Let me pull the blind so you can see. It's a little fire pit in the back, doghouse, 
uh, like I said, there's our garage. It's been uh, turned into a uh, more of a storage barn. So as I said, we're at 4313 East Minnesota Street. We have a three bedroom, one bath home. Uh, original hardwood floors throughout, uh, as well as tile floors in the kitchen and dining area. Uh, lots of windows and natural light, overhead lighting in all the rooms. Uh, very nice quaint house, about a thousand square feet, plus a little bonus uh, storage area out in the old garage. If this is the kind of property you're looking for, then I would encourage you to call our leasing agent at 317-484-8444. Four, four, extension one. They can give you more details, answer any questions you might have, as well as schedule a time for a private viewing. You can also get a list of all of our current listings on our website at www.rpmindymetro.com. Uh, you can get more details about this house and other houses and our video walkthroughs. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video and we look forward to helping you find your next place to live.